Hi, I'm Matt from eSpares. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change a pump on this LG washing machine. Now, the pump is used to circulate water around the machine and to drain water out of the machine. A few easy checks you can do before replacing. Have a look at your filter. Make sure there's no debris or damage there. And the same for the cavity. Check for debris or damage. Also with the drain hose, make sure there's no blockages or splits. If you put the machine through another wash and it still isn't draining or circulating water, the chances are you're going to have to replace the pump. The important thing is, to make sure you get the exact pump for your model, you're going to need the exact model number of your appliance. To do that, on this model, it's inside the door on a silver rating plate, as you can see there, WM1222. 5FD. Also, safety first. Always remember to unplug the appliance before carrying out any work. Now, to get to the pump, what I'm going to have to do is remove the whole of the front panel and the top. Let's start by taking the top off. Then, just pull the top back and lift off. To remove the front control panel or fascia, I first need to remove the detergent drawer using the quick release. Then I need to remove these two Phillips head screws here and two clips at the back. Now to release these clips, just use a screwdriver or blunt instrument just to pop them out. just rest it on the top there. Now, to remove the kick strip, simply use a flathead screwdriver or coin to release the filter flap. Then what I need to do is release the front drain hose and then unscrew this Phillips head screw here. And then it simply pops off. Now, to remove the front panel with the door, first need to open the door up and release the retaining band around the door seal. And for that, I'm just going to use a very blunt knife just to ease the band off. And then release the door seal off the outer lip. Just then rest that in the drum. Then unscrew these two Phillips head screws for the door lock. And then I need to remove two Phillips screws at the top. And then three Phillips head screws at the bottom. And then the panel will simply come away. Once you've removed the front panel of the washing machine, removing the pump is actually quite simple. You have these three Phillips head screws here, three pipes connected with Jubilee clips on the top, and one electrical connector at the bottom. Now, uh, top tip, I'm just going to take a quick picture on my camera phone of the pipes so I know exactly which position to put them back in. Start by removing your screws. Once you have the screws out, you need to release these pipes with the Jubilee clips. For that you need a pair of pliers. Pinch the Jubilee clips like that, and the hoses should just pop off. For the electrical connector, just a simple clip there, flathead screwdriver, push that down, and that should simply pop out, like so. And 
go. Now it's a good idea because you've got water pipes just to have a rag around just to clean up any mess that the pump may leave. Any water dripping out the pipes. And you're ready to put the new pump into position. Now, using your camera phone as reference if you need to, reconnect your pipes. Reconnect the electrical connector. Feed your new front drain hose through. Now all I need to do is put it back together. So, that's one brand new pump fitted to this LG washing machine. Now, if you need to find a new pump for your machine, you can find it at the eSpares.co.uk website. Thanks for watching.